Five nine, 195 pounds too. Mm -hmm. Williams, another nifty run, and he has a first down into BC territory to the 43 yard line. Two carries already 18 yards for Kyron Williams. Also an excellent pass receiver. Here's Michael Mayer, the terrific freshman tight end, and he's out of bounds with another Notre Dame first down. Jonathan Doerr kicked four field goals last week, another one of the heroes of that win over Clemson. Athlete who's been in the NFL, and he's got three years of eligibility here. It's a perfect situation for Phil. And they run a pro-style offense. He has a man wide open in the flat. And having a tough time moving is C.J. Lewis. I don't know if he injured himself as he had to bend for that throw. State in South Bend for Lou Holtz, 31-24. So a lot of similarities between 93 and this season. Here's Travis Levy through a hole. And inside the 25-yard line. They strive for balance. And heavily on the pass early in the year. Running better now. Here comes a blitz and Sean Crawford. Takes down his former teammate, Jakovic, back at the 31. Second and goal from the four. They come after Jakovic again. He loves it up for Zay Flowers and an acrobatic catch for a Boston College touchdown. No chance. The ball is thrown behind the receiver, but watch the adjustment Zay Flowers makes in the back of the end zone. Tracks the football. He recruited the knee and book. Hard to argue with Ian Book retaining the job with the way he's played. He has trouble on the handoff with Chris Tyree and Boston College has recovered. Brandon Barlow gets it back for BC. 41 yard field goal try for Aaron Bouberry. And that one is right down the middle. The opportunity to play right away was very important to him. He knew very little about Boston College. Ian Book has a man open. It's Avery Davis, another of the heroes of that win against Clemson. In the portal, and they're going to go find somewhere else to play, and it's worked out great for both guys. Yes. Design quarterback draw by Book. He runs over a defender. Austin and Lindsey are speed guys. They haven't been able to go much. Corner throw up for grabs for Skoranek. He caught it even with a flag down and with Brandon Sebastian all over him. An apparent Notre Dame touchdown it was really impressive. Great concentration. You could see Sebastian didn't know where the ball was. Notre Dame to maybe just rush three and drop into coverage and make him throw it underneath. Kovic five out of ten for 45 yards in retreat. Stays on his feet. Now has a man open and it is caught at the Notre Dame 32-yard line by Jalen Gill. 34-yard play as Boston College inside the Irish 30. And the completion to Gill. Great fake by Jakovic. And he's late tackled inside the 15-yard line by Clarence Lewis. Here's Bumeri, who connected from 41 in the first quarter. And that one's good from 31. Redshirt Jr. from Buffalo, New York. The nation's leading tacklers. Third down and ten. Book surrounded, got it free, and here's Avery Davis again. Down the sideline and inside the five, and he'll be marked out at the two-yard line. He's come on these last couple of weeks. Great look from the progressive pylon cam. Now here's Sebo Flemister, powerful runner, comes in in short yardage, and he's in the end zone for a Notre Dame touchdown and the Irish lead. He's going to lead the way. Watch the left side of the offensive line. It's a veteran, powerful, big, experienced group. Second and goal from the 13. Book was in trouble. Got away again. Finds his man, Skoranek, for a touchdown. Wow, this is so good by Ian Book. Looking here first. But the linebacker is in coverage, so watch Ian Book adjust. He's looking right, it's not there. So he moves, he extends the play, and then he finds Skoranek on the opposite side of the formation. Thrown for 187 yards and run for 42 and uh, leading this team. Phil Jakovic on target, C.J. Lewis for about 13.
Stay out of third down and long. Play action pass. Deep throw for an open receiver, and it's caught. Ball took a while to get to Jalen Gill as two defenders converged, but he caught it. Mary's two for two today. This is the 35-yard try. And he hasn't missed dead center yet. All three right down the middle. With no positive right. results. I mean, it's all about sacrificing for one another, and it kind of fits that model. Ian Book over the middle. Kyron Williams makes a man miss. Lost the football on the tackle, and the Eagles have it. At the 42-yard line. Before down territory here, and on the fringe of Bumiri's race. Oh, the snap was poorly timed. Jacobic didn't know it was coming. There is a flag down on the play at the line of scrimmage. Dalen Hayes has it for the Irish. Tyron Williams, the running back. Notre Dame can't have a play end in the field. Oh to the corner of the end zone for Skoranek again, and he hangs on for his third touchdown of the half. Body, throw it up. Skoranek in the slot, running to the corner, put it up in the air, let the big guy go catch it. Had separation. Third down and 10. Travis Levy, the running back. Jakovic has time, fires on target. C.J. Lewis, a first down to the Notre Dame 31-yard line. They convert on third down. Book throws, it's Skoranek again, and now the ball That's is out. Fumble. And it is a live ball. That's a fumble, and Boston College has it back. Committed only five all season prior to today. The three a season high they committed to against Florida State. And Boston College capitalized. Dracovic throws it right back into the hands of Jack Kaiser. He's stripped. Ball's on the ground, but it looked like Kaiser got it back. He remains the tailback. He follows Trimble. And again, poor tackling. And a touchdown. Lamont. Once again, hit him behind the line of scrimmage. Did not get him down. After the Skoranek fumble, but the defense got it right back. And the Irish score again. Third down and one. You'd have to think again four down territory, if need be. There's, There's the Bailey into the end zone for a touchdown. Back in, and he powered it in to the end zone. David Bailey, Jr. from Ridgely, Maryland. Catholic institutions, Notre Dame and Boston College, Ian Book and the Irish. Trying to go to 8-0. A little trickery to begin the fourth quarter. Avery Davis with some running room down the far sideline, showing his speed and finally taken out of bounds. Inside the 30, they're going to mark it at the 28. He thought to himself, this can't be Ian Book's legacy. They have to come back and win this game. And Ian told his coach, don't worry about it. We are going to come back and win the game. And he was the biggest reason why. He's into the end zone again. Touchdown, Notre Dame on the run for Ian Book. Three receivers here. They're all going to be covered. So this is good defense. But it's not great discipline on the pass rush. And he sees some opening. And he uses that little burst, that little acceleration. What is even happening? I'm eight the way months she pregnant, runs around, but I run boxes around. everyone around. It's pretty impressive. You wouldn't know it. Jakovic to the end zone. That's a touchdown for BC. So Molly's alma mater fighting all the way to the finish. Hunter Long, their outstanding tight end. Oh, getting him the football. Here he is right here. He's just going to work across the, the front edge of the goal line. Again, big target. There's the separation, and he shields the safety away with his body and makes the catch. I mentioned earlier he leads all tight ends in the country by. It's kind of is a different feel for them. Maybe they try him again on short yardage, and this time it works. Quick slice into the end zone for two. Another Holy War game is in the books, this one with no real controversy and Brian Kelly has now won 100 games as head coach at Notre Dame. 
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.